our pastor, Dr. Gregory Johnson. We've got Ricardo back in here with us today for his second adjustment. Uh, when he came in the first time, we did a thorough history and examination on him like we do all of our patients, and he complained of mid-back and upper thoracic pain, lower back pain, left leg pain, which is called sciatica, left SI joint pain, and numbness and tingling down his left leg, which is called paresthesia. And he also has some neck pain and stiffness. And he hasn't had any new accidents or injury since his last visit. So first thing I'm going to do is check his posture like we do on everyone. Let's have you close your eyes and bend your head forward and backwards for me, please, Ricardo. And back to neutral. Okay, ne neutral. There you go. Take a look in the mirror and tell me what you see, Ricardo. See how your head's still way forward? Yes, sir. Your ear's all the way out here still. you got to quit looking down at your phone all the time. <laughs> that's what that's from. You on the computer a lot on your cell phone? Yes, sir. Yep. Still sleeping on your side, too, I see. Yeah. Mm-hmm. See your head's a little forward and right? Pelvis is shifted left to center. you got more room here than you do over here. So we're going to do the ring dinger first then, Ricardo. Let's have you go ahead and lay on your back on this table. Pelvis right here. Head up this way. And down just a little bit more. There you go. Yep. Lay, lay back. I just want you to tell us going to your back. There you go. About another half inch. There we go. So you see the difference in Ricardo's frame. He's a little bit thinner than some of our patients. So I still get him pinned in there tightly. And I still do a high velocity, low amplitude thrust on the Y axis when I'm doing his ring dinger. However, because of his bone structure and his musculoligaments attachments to that, his is going to be a little different than what you see in here normally. Take a nice deep breath. Just like that. See, I didn't put the amount of body weight and force into that adjustment. You always have to tailor each adjustment to the patient's unique musculoskeletal conditions. Yeah, let me have this one. Ooh, crackhead's gonna love you too, Ricardo. Look at you, good job. I think Ricardo's a crackhead too. Didn't you find this on YouTube? Yes, sir. He liked the cracking yes, adjustments, huh? Well, crackhead's gonna love you now too, Carlos. Let me help you up sideways. There we go. Let's come over here and tell me next. No, head up that way for me. I don't think you want me checking the <laughs> <laughs> Legs are even. That's a good start. Got a little shorter on that right side. Did that tighten up a little bit in your lower back and your thighs? Yes, sir. Okay. So I'm going to start off with his right sacrum. Then the sacrum in the center and the left sacrum, sacroiliac. L5 straight P to A, L4 straight P to A, L3 straight P to A. Start working up into L2 and L1. You got to put a little inferior to superior line of drive on it. It's all technique. There you go. Okay, one more. There. Now let's recheck this. Still even here. Let's see if they stay even this time. Still gets a little short there. Does that tighten up at all? Yes, sir. Okay. So see, I'm getting on this left or the right side of the table with him now, and I'm going to hit that SI joint a little harder on this right side, his sacrum, his SI joint. We'll see if that keeps his legs even the whole way. And yes, it does. Did that feel easier that time? So sometimes you gotta go back and adjust these joints if you don't get them in place all the way the first time. I've never been accused of under adjusting. Okay, let's turn you on your back. But my patients love it that way. They always complain about them being under adjusted. So when they come here, I give them a full body adjustment. Slide down this way a little bit. There you go. And put both arms out like this for me, Ricardo. Okay. Kind of more like Jesus. There you go. Yep. There 
There you go. Okay, you can relax your hands right there. No, I'm gonna tell me. There you go. Let me have this right leg. There you go. You should have felt that from the all the way up to your lower back, Ricardo, did you? Yes, sir. Good. Let me have this one too. Perfect. Okay. Now let's sit you up face that way. Face that way for me. There you go. Keep that head straight. Let go. I'll do it. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, you're a little on the tight side today. You stressed out about something? No. Okay, good. There we go. Good. Okay, let's stand up over here. Let me use this instrument on you. This is an Arthur stem. It delivers repetitive, high velocity, low amplitude thrust that allows me to reset the muscle spindles on the paraspinal muscles. When I use it on the paraspinal muscles, it sends a proprioceptive neurological input into the cerebellum. And I'm going to hold these here. This is called mirror image atlas adjusting. I always finish off with this adjustment because I put the patient into a mirror image of their current biomechanical configuration. When I adjust the atlas on the x-axis, it reverberates between the occiput and C2 cells down in the facet joints under the occiput and C2. And it sends the neurological information into his cerebellum, teaching his cerebellum how to react to and start holding him in this position as opposed to the position he came in as. So let your head forward and backwards again, Carlos. See if this feels any easier to you. Is that a little better? Yes, sir. Take a look in the mirror at neutral. Still the biggest thing with you is this forward head posture. So 45 times a day, 15 in the morning, 15 around lunch, 15 in the afternoon. That should help you get well quicker. We always give our patients homework so that they can participate in their care and get well quicker and stay that way longer. What would you like to share with our crack addicts worldwide about your two experiences here at Advanced Chiropractic Relief? Man, it was great. Um, I felt some relief first time. I had to come the second time, you know. Come visit the best chiropractor in Houston, man. Well, thank That's you. That's all I got to say. Thank you very much. Thanks You're for welcome. sharing your experience with everyone on YouTube today. This is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief in Houston, Texas, with Ricardo from Houston, Texas. We'll see y'all soon.